Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of King Tech. I'm your host, Corey here. And today we have a follow-up video of my Tumi Tahoe Edition Ridgewood book bag. Um, I've been using this book bag for over a year now, so I'm gonna get here to give you my what I've been liking about it, what I have been liking about it, and just give you a quick overview of the bag, okay? So let's get into it. Let's go. All right, so now me personally, I've been using this book bag as a tech book bag. And the reason I chose to use this as a tech book bag is for one reason. Tumi has this great feature and it's inside of all of their luggage, inside of all of their book bags. It's called a Tumi Tracer. This Tumi Tracer here allows you to find your book bag anywhere in the world. Once you register with Tumi, you can find it. They can look, up, look it up for you and you can get back what you lost. And that's amazing. If you carry around expensive equipment, I love having that feature built into the bag. So he's been doing that for a long time. So that's the number one feature I've been using this bag for as far as a tech book bag. Now, secondly, I've been loving how clean, how easy it is to clean this book bag. I love this material. Um, it's been really easy to just get a brush out and some soap and just clean it and not have to worry about it getting too dirty. And then also another great feature is this rain sleeve that comes on the bottom you just zip it out and you can just throw this over the book bag and it makes it keeps everything inside the book bag nice and safe and keeps all the elements away from your tech that you have inside the book bag so next up let's talk about all the different compartments of the book bag and what you can actually carry inside of those different compartments so me as a tech youtuber i carry a lot of things that i need for my everyday videos or just when i'm out doing uh, whatever I need to be doing, all right? So on the side here, we have two main side compartments and I love that fact because you can fit a lot of different things in here. So we already talked about this compartment here with the Tumi Tracer, but inside this compartment, you also have these different sleeves and I keep my Samsung T7 SSD inside of here. It just slides right in there and you can fit a ton of stuff in here, but that's basically what I'm carrying inside that side compartment there. Then we also have another side sleeve over here. And this was more to slide, you know, whatever, it's like some slim things in. And I keep my dongle for my MacBook Pro inside of there. This thing has three USB ports, SSD, micro SD, HDMI, USB-C, even has a VGA port. So it has everything you're gonna need for your everyday dongle activity. And then moving on to the other side here, um, one cool thing about Tumi bags is you can personalize. So me, I have CRK right there in my initials, uh, and that's a really cool feature to make your book bag your own. All right, so also on the side here, we have two more side compartments to fit a lot more stuff in. I keep my portable charger here. This is my Jackery 2100 milliamp hour portable charger here. This thing's been with me through thick and thin. Uh, so I've been loving that as well. Next up, we also have over here a this side apartment and this one has some netting and a sleeve here it's great for keeping cables in and we also have a netting up there to keep chargers and just different stuff like that in there as well so lots of side compartments to fit lots of different stuff in and then also we have this front sleeve here and you can put anything in here if you want but i've been keeping my phone in here lately and this is the Note 20 Ultra that I've been using. I just made a full review on this, so check that out. The link will be in the description for that, okay? All right, and then moving around back, we also have some compartments back here. We have this great hidden compartment on the back here that allows you to just slide whatever you need in there. I like the padding on the back of this book bag. It feels really good on your back. It doesn't feel like, you know, it's digging into your back. You also have this pass-through as well. And this is great for when you want to slide on top of your luggage, when you're going through your airport, whatever you may be doing. If you want to slide that on your luggage, you can do that. And for me, any book bag has to have a laptop compartment. And this one has one of the best laptop compartments. So you unzip these two on the back here and you have access to the laptop compartment. And here I have my 15 inch MacBook Pro. I just did a full review on this one as well. So I'll leave the link for this one in the description so you can check that out. But this has a lot of padding to keep everything in here safe. You have a compartment right here for the laptop. And then also with this book bag, this book bag has the top compartment here. And if I do have one gripe about this backpack, it's the fact that I feel like this compartment can have a little bit more organization in this top sleeve. 
So really everything kind of just gets thrown in here, which isn't a big deal, but for me, I would like for it to have a few more compartments inside of this whip bag. So inside of here, I've been keeping my sound core headphones. These are some noise canceling headphones I got off Amazon. I made a review on these as well, so you can check that out. These are some $40 noise canceling headphones and they're absolutely amazing. So check that out. Link will be in the description. We also have my camera strap that I can fit inside of here. We have my gimbal that I've been using on for the last video. So if you've been loving the new panty shots I've been getting with all my videos, this is how I've been getting that. And that's pretty much it for everything. But like I said, you have a lot of space in the bottom of here. You can get as many, you can get as much as you want in there or as little as you want. But that's probably the best thing about this bag. You can stuff it and it won't look like it's stuffed. It's been a good bag, book bag over the last year or so, and I've been loving it. It's held up pretty well. Tumi does have a five year warranty on this book bag, so I'm loving that. If I do have any problems with it, I can take it right back to Tumi. So that is pretty much it, guys. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos like this. Don't forget to hit the like button, leave comments, let me know what you think about the book bag or what you think about the videos. Just let me know what you think, okay? And I will catch you all in the next one. Peace out.